Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a one brand tutorial. I am using all milk makeup products and this is the look I came up with. It's just really dewy, glowy skin and a dark, bold lip. I really, really like how it came out. And yeah, if you guys wanna see, do I have lipstick? No, I don't. If you guys wanna see how I got this look, then please keep on watching. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the Milk Makeup Blur Primer. I actually really, really like this primer. Um, it does a really good job at kind of smoothing your pores and just giving you a nice smooth base to apply foundation. It feels like nothing once you put it on and you kind of rub it. It feels like absolutely nothing. Okay, next I'm going to go in with the Sunshine Skin Tint. I am in the color Sand. And this is really cool. It's a rollerball type of application. So you kind of click it up. If I could get some. And it just comes up like that. And then you roll it like this on your skin. That might have been a bit too much, but we shall see. This is a more medium, sheer medium coverage. It's not going to give you full coverage. That's why it's called a skin tint. It's more meant to just give you a little bit of color and even out your skin tone. I'm going to take my beauty blender and blend this out. Now, like I said, this does not give you a lot of coverage, but if you do really, really want to try this product, just put this on first and then go over the spots that you need to conceal with a fuller coverage concealer. You can see that's really evening out my skin tone. It's giving a really nice dewy finish. Next, I'm going to go in with the Flex Concealer. I have the color Light Medium. And so this is supposed to be a full coverage concealer and it's called flex concealer because apparently it's supposed to move with your face so that it doesn't crack or that's how they explain it on the website I'm just gonna take this in the normal areas to kind of highlight my skin at the same time I'm gonna lightly just bounce that in with my beauty blender so it definitely is full coverage that's covering up my dark circles really really nicely my skin is very dry right now and it's not clinging to any of the dry patches which is nice so that's the concealer on one side I actually really really like that so far so next I'm going to go in with the Milk Makeup Highlight. This is a cream highlight in the color Lit. Um, it's a really pretty champagne color. And I just take that directly onto my skin. I kind of just, I'm not too precise with this. I kind of just try to put it in this C motion like that. I also like to put that above the brows. And the center of my nose and as always I'm gonna blend that out with my beauty blender don't use a lot of pressure when you're blending out the highlight and that'll make sure that your beauty blender doesn't suck it all up I apply a lot of this just because once you blend it out it looks very um, subtle I'm gonna go in with the bronzer next this is their matte cream bronzer in the color baked I believe this is a sample size I don't have the bigger size yet and I'm just gonna take that down the face like that I'm gonna take my beauty blender and I'm gonna blend that out I go in like small upward strokes like this could see that gives you a really beautiful soft bronze I really 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 love this product I think it's one of my favorites 
I'm also going to take that um, around the perimeters of my face. So right there and then along the jaw. And then again, I'm going to blend that out with my beauty blender. I'm going to go in with the blush oil. This is in the color Crave. It's a really pretty peachy color. And this is the same thing. So you, oh no, this one you click. Nope. This one you also click up like this and then the product starts to appear at the roller ball and then you would just roll it on. Just gives you a really beautiful subtle wash of color. You guys, I think we did this whole tutorial just using the Beauty Blender. I mean, everybody needs a beauty blender in their life. Everybody. I'm going to go in with this Bare Minerals one and I'm going to take my beauty blender and I'm just going to set under my eyes. And amazingly, that concealer has not creased on me at all. I don't have a Milk Makeup Eye product, so I'm just going to use some of these products. I'm going to go in with the bronzer and I'm just going to put that right here. I'm kind of just aiming roughly at my crease. This will just give your eyes a little bit of definition just so they're not too bare. And I kind of bring it out like this towards the temple area. Then I'm going to go in with Lit Highlight again on the finger. And I'm going to pop that in the very center. I'm going to go apply some mascara and then I shall be right back. To finish off, I'm going to use the Lip Vinyl. This is a new product. It's kind of like a melted lipstick. It has the coverage of a lipstick, but then it's supposed to be glossy. I got the darkest berry color. I've lined my lips a little bit with some lip liner, I don't remember which one. And it's a doe foot applicator like this. It's supposed to be really full coverage. That's really pretty. It's a little bit patchy, but that might be fixable. Okay, you guys, so that is the lip on. This was a little bit difficult to work with. It was a little patchy, but I think that's because the color is so dark and pigmented. I don't think that the lighter colors would do that. But yeah, that is the look. I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.